everybody has self image and that self image is formed by number 1 one's own action number 2 self image is formed through my past actions number 3 self image is formed through what i want to become in the future and number 4 self image is formed through what others have said about me a person who smokes his self image about self control will not be that good those who drink those who smoke do you think they have very positive self image somewhere they know that i am not controlled i am a slave of something first thing is create a beautiful self image and self image will not come by just thinking i am good i am good that is ego self image is that this has to be done i can do it there is a confidence i could make it i can do it second thing that enhances was our past actions if the past of the person is not glorious he has done something too bad here and there cheated somewhere or done something not that memory will keep on haunting be very careful nothing will be erased we will get the fruit of action somebody will come somebody come will come from outside to tell us to remind us third thing is future what i want to be what i want to be doesn't means i want to be doctor engineer or or something like that what mind i want i want determination i want purity i want undisturbed mind i want the mind which is not afraid let the hell fall on my head i want the mind which is equanimous if this is the mind i want i should remember it i'll work for it so we should have this thing also what i want to be in the future third point and fourth point is how others be that also determines when you see when you hear your praise from someone and genuine praise you are inspired this is called the charm of living to love and to be loved these three these four factors are those pointers through which it tells us where our action thoughts intentions convictions faith should be pointed at